Blessings, 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 beloved. I am Mama Pam, a.k.a. Pamela Dobson, and I do read the Word of God seven minutes every day, so you do not have to read. We are back resuming our read for Tuesday, September the 8th, 2020, uh, reading from Leviticus, Leviticus the 13th chapter, resuming at verses 6, uh, woman's, uh, people to sanctify themselves, woman's atonement offering, oh, it's about the women's now, plague of leprosy, and a plague on the head or in the beard, oh my God, code on the Okay, we'll be reading from the King James Version of the Word of God, and it reads, And the priest shall look on him again the seventh day. And behold, if the plague be somewhat dark, and the plague spread not in the skin, the priest shall pronounce him clean, if it is but a scab. And he shall wash his clothes and be clean. But if the scab spread much abroad in the skin, after that he hath been seen of the priest for his cleansing, he shall be seen of the priest again. And if the priest see that, behold, the scab spreadeth in the skin, then the priest shall pronounce him unclean, for it is a leprosy. The skin turning white is a leprosy. And the plague of leprosy is in a man. When the plague of leprosy is in a man, then he shall be brought into the priest. And the priest shall see him, and behold, if the rising be white in the skin, and it have turned the hair white, and there be quick raw flesh in the rising. It is an old leprosy in the skin of his flesh, and the priest shall pronounce him unclean, and shall not shut him up, for, the, for he is unclean. And if a leprosy break out abroad in the skin, and the leprosy cover all the skin of him that hath the plague, from his head even to his foot, wheresoever the priest looketh, then the priest shall consider, and behold, if a leprosy have covered all his flesh, he shall pronounce him clean that hath the plague. It is all turned white. He's clean. If his whole body done turn white, he's clean. He had the leprosy. But when raw flesh appear in him, he shall be unclean. And the priest shall see the raw flesh and pronounce him to be unclean. For the raw flesh is unclean, it is leprosy. Or if the raw flesh turn again and be changed unto white, and he shall come unto the priest, and the priest shall see him, and behold, if the plague be turned into white, then the priest shall pronounce him clean that hath the plague. He is clean. He clean with the plague. His skin not turn white. Uh-oh. The flesh also in which even the skin thereof was a boil and is healed. And in the place of the boil, there be a white rising or a bright spot, white and somewhat reddish. And it be shoot the priest. And if when the priest seeth it, behold, it be in sight lower than the skin, and the hair turneth it, the, the hair thereof be turned white, the priest shall pronounce him unclean. It's a plague of leprosy, broken out of the boil. But if the priest look on it, and behold, there be no white hairs therein, and it be not lower than lower than the skin, but be somewhat dark. Then the priest shall shut him up for seven days. And if it spread much abroad in the skin, then the priest shall pronounce him unclean. It's a plague. It's a plague. But if the bright spot stay in his place and spread not, it's a burning boil. And the priest shall pronounce him clean. Or if there is any flesh in the skin, Whereof there is a hot burning, and the quick flesh that burneth have a white, bright spot, somewhat reddish or white. Then the priest shall look upon it, and behold, if the hair in the bright spot be turned white, and it be in sight deeper than the skin, it's a leprosy broken out of the burning. Wherefore the priest shall pronounce him unclean. It's the plague of leprosy. My God, my God. But... If the priest look on it, and behold, there be no white hair in the bright spot, and it be lower than the other skin, 
but be somewhat dark. Then the priest shall shut him up for seven days. And the priest shall look upon him the seventh day. And if it be spread much abroad in the skin, then the priest shall pronounce him unclean. It is the plague of leprosy. And if the bright spot stay in his place and spread not in the skin, but it be somewhat dark, it is a rising of the burning. And the priest shall pronounce him clean, for it is an inflammation of the burning. And if a man or woman hath a plague upon the head or beard, then the priest shall then the priest shall see the plague. And behold, if it be in sight deeper than the skin, and there be in it a yellow thin hair, then the priest shall pronounce him unclean. It's a dry scale, even a leprosy upon the head of the be- or the beard. And if the priest look on the plague of the scowl, and behold, it be not in sight deeper than the skin, and that there is no black hair in it, then the priest shall shut him up that hath the plague of the scowl seven days. And in the seventh day, the priest shall look on the plague. And behold, if the scowl spread not, and there be in it no yellow hair, and the scowl be not in sight deeper than the skin, he shall be shaven, but the scowl shall he not shave. And the priest shall shut him up, that is the scowl, seven days more. And in the seventh day, the priest shall look on the scowl, and behold, if the scowl be not spread in the skin, nor be in sight deeper than the skin, Then the priest shall pronounce him clean, and he shall wash his clothes and be clean. But if the scowl spread much in the skin after his cleansing, and the priest shall look on him, and behold, the scowl be spread in the skin, the priest shall not seek for yellow hair. He is just unclean. But if the scowl be in his sight at a stay, and that there is black hair grown up therein, the scowl is healed, and he is clean. And the priest shall pronounce him clean. Now if a man also or a woman have in the skin of their flesh bright spots, even white bright spots, then the priest shall look and behold, if the bright spots in the skin of their flesh be darkish white, it is a freckled spot that groweth in the skin. It is clean. He is clean. And the man whose hair is fallen off his head, he is bald, yet he is clean. May the Lord add a blessing to me, the reader, and you, the hearer of this precious and sacred word of God. It's talking about leprosy. It's talking about white skin. Uh, In order for you to get leprosy, for your skin to turn whitish color, white or whatever they're saying, Uh, I would suggest, I would suggest you had to have had dark skin. You had to have started with dark skin in order for the skin to turn white or get white spots. Don't your skin got to be darker? I'm just saying. We just reading the word. Amen. Agree or disagree, but this is what the word of God says and this is what I believe. I want to say thank you, thank you, thank you for being a part of the Smurf Club for your continued donation of $20 to paypal.me forward slash Pamela Dobson, paypal.me forward slash Pamela Dobson. We read um, across 16 social media platforms every day at noon, and it is noon right this minute as I'm looking at the clock. Gotta go. Bye.